hello beautiful people welcome back to my channel in today's video i'll be showing you how i made this fufu using different kinds of fruits yeah i actually made this fufu with fruits yes so if you want to know how i made it keep watching and watch till the end and please don't forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel thank you all right all right all right okay 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 welcome back amazing people so what do you do with the chaps that you get from your fruits after extracting the juice this is actually the chaps that i got from these fruits as you can see and in today's video i'll be using them to make my fufu this is exactly why i like using a chiffon cloth to sieve the juice after blending it instead of using um sieve i like using a chiffon cloth so guys i'll be leaving the link on how i got these chaps in my description box or at the comment section down below do well to check out how i got this chaff from those fruits that i showed earlier on it's just a one minute video so it won't take much of your time just check it out okay and support your girl as well so i started by pouring everything inside my pot and i'll go ahead and mix it properly as you can see they have different colors that is because i use different fruits you know the one that looks like orange color is because of um the presence of carrots in the fruit and the one that looks like um would i call it the one that the color is green let me just say put it that way is because of the cucumber i think so and other green fruits in it so after mixing it, as you can see, I'll finish mixing it. I'll go ahead and place it in my gas cooker and then start stirring everything up and mixing it properly. One good thing about using um, a chiffon cloth to sieve out your juice when you're making your fruit juice is because it will give you a very solid um chaff <laughs> yeah let me put it that way you know as you can see how solid this is it helps to drain out the water completely and but the day i'm making this fufu is not the day i made the the fruit juice yeah i actually made the fruit juice two days before i made i made the fufu so i added additional water as you can see because it looks very thick and I wanted it to, you know, be a little bit soft. Can you see? As you can see, it cannot mold properly. So I'll go ahead and use my selenium hox. This is what my selenium hox looks like because I got it here. I think they call it selenium hox book or something. Book or book. I don't know how to pronounce it in Italian, but in English is selenium hox. So I went ahead and added selenium hox, just one spoon, because I needed the fufu to be moldable. 
I don't know if that English is correct, but I believe you guys know what I'm talking about. Now looking at it, you will notice, you will see that the fufu is gradually forming. So, after five minutes, I'll be bringing it down because the fufu is ready. So this is my plastic frame. I sprinkle the little water and then put in the fufu. One good thing about this fufu, guys, is it's low carb, no calories, very light. Guys, I finished eating it and it's like I didn't eat anything. But I just tried to, you know, hold myself because I really need to lose weight. It is also super healthy. So from today, don't throw away the chaff after making your yeah, fruit juice. juice. Nothing is a waste. The residue is not a waste. You drink the juice and use the residue for your fufu. You see? <laughs> So here is my fufu. My fufu is ready. Guys, don't mind this by lightning. It's just messing the whole thing up. <laughs> so I'll go ahead and enjoy it with my obono soup. But I think the best soup for this is okra or vegetable soup. Yeah. I enjoy it better. I'll be best with okra or vegetable soup mm, this is so yummy guys can you see that it's a little bit sugary you know because of the fruit but if you don't want it to be sugary while preparing it, instead of adding water you can use lemon or lime just to give it a little bit sour taste so that it will not be that um sweet you know so that is all for this video please like share and subscribe to my channel bye and see you all in my next video